Hello everyone, today I got a whole chicken from Netto for a really low price and now I'm gonna make tandoori chicken out of it so let's get started. First I remove the skin of the chicken, you can keep the skin on but personally I remove the skin so that the marination process is easier. Then I made cuts in the chicken so the marinade soaks in properly. Then I started making the first marinade for which I took 1 tablespoon of chilli powder, salt as per taste, 2 tablespoons of ginger garlic paste and juice of half a lemon. The lemon juice helps tenderizing the chicken meat so that our chicken will be more juicy and yummy when we cook it. After putting in all the ingredients, I gave it a good mix so that it forms a mixture. And then I properly covered the whole chicken in the first marinade. After the chicken was fully covered in the marinade, I kept it aside. It's better to keep it aside for at least half an hour. Meanwhile, you can start preparing for the second marinade. To begin the second marinade, I took 2 tablespoons of rapeseed oil to which I added a mixture of 1 tablespoon chili powder and 1 tablespoon tandoori masala. Then I added half tablespoon of salt, 1 tablespoon of garam masala, half tablespoon of turmeric powder, half tablespoon of coriander powder and 1 tablespoon of dried fenugreek. Once everything was added to the mixture, I gave it a good mix to form a paste to which I added 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste and 3 tablespoons of curd. The yogurt acts as a good binder for the marinade. After putting all the ingredients in, I gave it a good mix to form a paste. Once the marinade was prepared, I started coating the chicken with the marinade. I completely covered the whole chicken with the marinade. Then I used my hand so that there is no spot left on the chicken which is not marinated. The chicken is now marinated and I have set it aside in the refrigerator for uh, marinating overnight. You can also keep it for 2-3 to three hours but the more you keep it, the more tender the chicken will become. So I'm gonna keep it overnight and I'll see you tomorrow. One eternity later. Hello everyone, it's finally the morning and now it's time to put the chicken in the oven. I have preheated the oven at 200 degrees Celsius and now I'm gonna put in the chicken. Before putting the chicken into the oven, I sprayed it with some oil. You can also directly apply the oil onto the chicken. Then I sprinkled some basin on it also known as gram flour. The gram flour helps in the formation of a crunchy layer outside the chicken. Once it was fully covered, I put it in the oven for 30 minutes on one side. After 30 minutes, I took the chicken out and turned it upside down so that the other side gets roasted properly. After turning the chicken around, I did the same thing as I did in the start, sprayed it with some oil and then I sprinkled some gram flour on top of it. Once again, I put the chicken back in the oven for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, the chicken will be juicy and ready to be served. So finally the tandoori chicken is ready and now I'm gonna enjoy it. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and share with your friends. And for more such content, subscribe to the channel.